All right, everyone. Welcome to Tomahawk DIY. Today we'll be taking a look at the hard drive on a Dell Inspiron laptop. To install a new hard drive, you take your hard drive assembly, uh, take the frame, I should say, and you're going to secure that frame to the hard drive. I like to loosely put in the four screws and then go to make sure they're all positioned and threaded properly before tightening everything down. Again, use care with Handling the hard drive and computer electronics. It's a good idea to be in a place where you won't be disturbed and won't pick up electrostatic charges. Some folks will touch some metal to ground themselves or use a grounding strap. I can't say I've ever done that, never had problems, but I can't guarantee you won't. Once the hard drive is uh, secured back into the frame, simply slip the frame back in place. You're going to now slide the hard drive, use the tab, apply some pressure, um, and the hard drive is slid back in to make its connections. Recommend using care not to lose screws. Again, I'm putting these in uh, loosely at first to make sure they're all in alignment. And then I'll go back around to tighten them back down. The one thing this uh, video does not cover is uh, preparing your hard drive to actually run uh, use your computer, uh, loading an operating system and um, dealing with any BIOS or setup items that might be necessary. So once you have properly secured all the screws, make sure everything's in place, there's no lingering parts. We can now restore or return this cover back into place. Snaps in. Be careful with the screw here, make sure it aligns. And away you go.